summer of that year was gorgeous. Every day seemed better than the last. Oh, Arthur, dear, I hope this super weather goes on forever. And it seemed as if it would. Now, this area of high pressure here ensures that the present fine spell will continue. Ball the dash, said Evil Edna, the Wicked Witch. I'll teach that know-all-weather man something about spells. Let it thunder! Let it lightning! Ah, ha, ha, ha. Now let it rain! Let it rain! Cats and dogs! Ah, Edna, you're a marvel! What about the dogs? <laughs> Meanwhile, the cat called Carwash and the Moog, who is a sort of dog, were hurrying home to shelter. Moog, said Carwash tartly, I find your irksome and ridiculous gait impeding my homeward progress. Kindly hurry, otherwise I shall be caught in the approaching storm. All right, Carwash, said the Moog. I shall go really, really fast. That's funny. That is funny. Very funny indeed. And that is even funnier. Mug, I fail to see what you'll find so amusing. Duh. Car wash, didn't you see that? Or that? No, my eyes are not first class, you know. Car wash, do you have lots and lots of brothers and sisters? Certainly not. I am unique. But he wasn't. Doily woods were full of car washes, and worse than that, also full of moogs, thousands and thousands of them. And things were to get worse. Some moogs started chasing the car washes. It was bedlam. In desperation, the real car wash and moog went to see Mavis Cruet, the fairy. Mavis, there are in these woods numbers of ill-behaved animals who are inferior replicas of the Moog and myself. We would deem it a favor if you could dispense a little, uh, magic and remove them all. Well, I'll try. <coughs> They've all gone! I've done it! First time, too! Now, you may think... There has been a nice, happy ending to this story, but... Fairy, you have made all my little doggies and pussycats vanish. Yes, I did, cried Mavis proudly. Then I shall cast one of my evil spells. All of you are now going to vanish forever and ever. Now, Edna, said Arthur the Caterpillar, if you was to do a rotten old thing like that, the whole world would know. Who'd be left to tell them, eh? Why, our little old mate, Willow the Wisp. Willow the what? Willow the Wisp, Edna. He's everywhere. He sees everything we do and then tells everyone about it on their televisions. Oh, he does, does he? I'll fix his nosy Parker game. I'll cast a spell that'll wreck every television set in the world. <laughs> now all their screens have gone black. They can't see a thing. Oh, the poor viewers. They must be getting ever so bored. Serve them right. <laughs> <laughs>